Hey, there he is. How you, How you doing? doing? Hey, what's going on? Oh, another day. You? We thought maybe you were sleeping or having lunch. One or the other. After lunch. After lunch. After lunch, After lunch nap. <laughs> uh, body, body break. Yeah. I've got my eye on you. I've got my eye on you. You what? Yeah. We have these flowers out here. This um, palette stuff, palette art. Department of Ag building. Yeah, this is uh, this doubles as Department of Ag and a way station. This one real quick over here. Yeah, this is Department of Ag and a way station, right? Yeah, it's just ag. Like the flag flying, of course, like they should be. They can only give you assistance via phone and email. Okay. How about that? Phone and email, that's it. Are they in the back room? Why is nobody in here? The car is set here. They're in the town hall. They're over there in the SNS. Yeah. Uh, Nobody here. We got an air conditioner running. Oh wow. Outside sink and soap. Probably stay here and wash your cars. Hey, there he is. How you doing? Hey, what's going on? Oh, another day. You? We thought maybe you were sleeping or having lunch, one or the other. After lunch. After lunch. After lunch, After lunch nap. <laughs> Body, body break. Yeah. Hey, what do you guys do with the PVC pipe in the floor? I don't know who put that in there. I think it was probably something that was in the road. Oh, maybe a good idea. Because, I mean, we'll, we'll stop and get trees down the road, animals. Yeah. Let me ask you a question. You wash your car here? Do you wash your car right here? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, ain't that against Florida law? I have no idea. The soap water in the river? Most of it goes right here. So. And it still goes in the ground and still ends up in the river. I have no idea, sir. You know, it's a $5,000 fine if a food vendor drops water on the ground in Florida. So I imagine this this water is no different. You see what I'm saying? I'm aware. I mean, if you take it up with supervision, I, I don't no, know. No, I, I know it's not you. I, I know it's not you. Maybe Something I'll have to ask. Yeah, a lot of people uh, knew my dad. Uh, 
had a lot of great things to say about it. Right. And then those same people talk shit to me because I walk around with a camera and exercise my First Amendment right. So I would be free to record. This is America, not Nazi Germany. It just gets it gets people nervous, and all of a sudden they got to they got to worry what they're doing. You you look real nervous right now. I'm telling you, it's real real nervous. Uh, well, listen, uh, most everybody got cameras on us, Sherry. You got cameras here? No, sir. Those are just LED I lights. I see their lights, yeah. No cameras here? No, oh, not that. cameras. We don't, some of the stations have uh, the cameras for the, uh, the identifiers for like the drive wise and stuff like that. Yeah. But we're on cameras everywhere we go, usually somewhere. Oh, yeah. You go, you're on camera over there at some stop. It's actually helping us. That's why I figured you was at over there. Uh, I just finished the uh, lunch. Oh. <laughs> Brown on both sides now, huh? <laughs> <laughs> so you were the only one here today? This station's always one. Always one. Always one. So let me ask you a question. Yes, sir. And I always wonder this myself. Uh, you guys inspect for you know agricultural stuff here, but they do it on the borders. Why internally? Well, the Swanee, Cat Swanee River is a natural boundary that cuts Florida into basically two okay. separate sections. So as you cross the rivers, they do that. Right, because it, you know a lot of other states don't have it. The reason being is because how are you going to have a station at 5,000 different roads that enter Georgia? Yeah. Or, so the only reason we put one here is because it's, that, it's, it's choke points. People have to cross these yeah. bridges in certain spots. Right. And you have the Okie Fanoke, which... That blocks yeah. that section. So you have them up at Yulee, you have them at McClenny, yeah. locations. Yeah, I noticed them like that. Yeah, I just was wondering why when you cross the borders, there's there's stations, but then in, in the center of the state, there's other ones. And what is it that you're really looking for? Can, can you explain it's that? Agricultural, for, it's marijuana. Agricultural. <laughs> no, it's strictly agricultural. Anything to do with agriculture. Marijuana is not agricultural. Okay, let's it, see. It, it is. Oh. But it, we're looking for something else. We're looking for permits. We're looking for certifications on plants. We're supposed to have certain certifications. Animals There's have to have. certified marijuana plants? Or just plants in general? Plants in general. Okay. They have to have nursery stamps and fire ants stuff. Certain things that other we don't want invasive pests coming in here. Oh, yeah, that's important. In Florida. We all seen the news where the, uh, you order a package. You know, in the mail, oh, and you get it, and you get those little seeds. Oh, I, I got them. Seeds. That's the kind of stuff. I yeah. got it. I ordered. I ordered a thing from Amazon that had all kinds of camera attachments. Right. And I get it. I open it up, and it has a pack of strawberry seeds in it. Like, what the hell is this? Just a random pack. I still got them. I didn't do anything with them. But you know, why would you put strawberry not seeds? To plant them. Don't plant them. And I, I, I think they're waiting. They're either waiting on information from the USDA to direct. Yeah. But one of the biggest things is do not plant them. I wouldn't no, plant on plant them. So. I don't know if there's a pest or if it's, yeah. you know, how we get the kudzu weed here yeah. in Florida. Kudzu. Takes over. Yeah. Kudzu. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the Chinese people are claiming that they're sharing the love. And with a coronavirus, the Chinese coronavirus being so strong here in America and, and getting in our population, even in, in very rural areas like Brantford, you know, so they claim they're sending those seeds for hope uh, that people can plant them and get food out of them and okay. bring a little sunshine into them. But I'd I don't believe them or Joe Biden or Epstein Island people. I'd say that there were, uh, somebody was saying they were trying to get likes or something off of Amazon. Well, they were sending free seeds and hoping but see, I don't know people how. would give them a, a, a good review. Well, I mean, I could see where I open this up and there's a pack of strawberry seeds and I'm like, oh, wow, cool, they sent me something extra, so yeah, I'll give them a review, but, you know, Who I knows? mean, that could be, but, you know. Hey, everybody's got a gimmick. What's your gimmick, then? I'm trying to retire. I'm trying to retire? How long you got? Three, three more years, you can drop. Yeah. You're not going to drop. Yeah. Get that big money. Get that big money, that's drop. Oh no, that's just, I'm going to do my eight years in the state. That's it? You'll be able to retire for good. Retire for good, live on my farm, enjoy. How many acres do you have? You said a farm? I 
Yeah. You grow you grow um, watermelon or trees? No, just my critters. What if I come across here a watermelon? What am I supposed to have? Oh, a single watermelon, no big deal. No, a whole truckload of watermelon. A whole truck water. You're gonna have to have a bill of lading. Oh, that's so that it. Shows where you got the watermelon from, where they're being. You can buy to. those from the pilot and fill them out yeah. yourself. You yeah. and all of it. I know is that. Just, it's, I know. It's kind of like an ownership <laughs> or type thing. You I mean, I know it. this, but I'm gonna have an audience here. That, oh, okay. You know. So all you do is you just have that form that says who the driver is, the date, where it's to be delivered to. I like the watermelons here, a lot of. A lot See, of we're not here to instigate people. We're here to educate people. Fine. You know, everybody likes to call us instigators. You but feel I, instigated, I don't, bag? I don't know where we instigate because yeah. you know, I mean, we what just about ask we questions. Asking you about you this teaches drugs. people. That's that's, that's, that's right there. Oh, that's makes it. everybody nervous. Exactly. What what is that? No, oh, the, the cameras. Oh, the cameras. Oh, just yeah. point that way. Yeah. Oh, I was wondering. I thought maybe some kind of game you guys had. Or something. No, no such thing. You have about, about to ask about the tattoos. I mean, we we know that the cameras can do that, but we don't understand why. Because we're in public, we're free well, to do that. It's just like when they have the newscasters going on, and you have somebody in the background that's got to be a goofball at the beach. Sometimes people get nervous. It's a it's a I don't think it's the same thing. Yeah, could be. You some people, see some my people shirt? get nervous. No. Photography not. is not a crime. That's a fact. But see, we we, we film government people. We don't go after the citizens. <laughs> right. And why do they get instigated by the cameras? They should be the ones that say, hey, no problem, see you later. Right. That We like them. Like you, you're, you're great, man. You're great. You're making this place like look good. Like Cameron, I mean, uh, smiling Sammy, Sammy St. John. Is the camera dash with the uh, old sheriff? Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm from Columbia County, yeah, so, so I don't really know much so, about uh, I don't remember if Cameron uh, got beat out by Sam St. John or Cameron retired anyway. Sam St. John took over Cameron. But, you know, there's a deputy here in Brantford that patrols this area often that was accused of sexual battery in Columbia County and in Swanee County. He had a fake Facebook page, nothing but young, uh, underage girls on it, over 40 girls on there. Right. They investigated him internal affairs. They told him that was unbecoming an officer. Unbecoming of an officer. That's fire. Right. No. Listen, take that Facebook down. Don't be touching them girls' boobies no more. You got to cut this out. You're a married man with children at home. There's no need for you running around having sex. And then the they had the sheriff's office or FDLE look into it. <laughs> they never sent anything to FDLE. Nothing. FDLE don't, the don't know about it. Office. Now listen. Oh, uh, just in you, case. You know, no, how no, I know We investigated ourselves and found no wrongdoing. You've seen it before, and I promote good cops and bad cops. Right. But if the good cops don't say anything about the bad, you ever cop, get them on you? It makes them guilty by association. I'm fucking right. That's what I was told. Right. You know, guilt by association was rammed down my neck, antagonistic. Who am I antagonizing you? But then what happened with uh, this guy is he. He leaves the department, goes to basic training, gets shipped overseas, and gets paid the whole time he's gone. 16 weeks boot camp, paid. I want that job. That's, you mean that's not customary to get paid when you go to boot no, camp? I have no clue. When I went, I went to boot camp a long time ago. Where'd you go to boot camp at? Actually, Fort Beginning. Fort Beginning, <laughs> he says Fort Beginning. Uh, so that's where it all uh, starts. <laughs> But see, that's the, up in Georgia, right? Yes, see, I, I'm paying this guy's wages. I, I paid that guy's wages. That pisses me off. You know, he shouldn't get paid. paid why he shouldn't be double dipping that way, especially so he got after paid 16 weeks of boot camp. He was paid for. He came back, worked a few months, and then got uh, letters, you know, orders, military orders right. uh, to go. Uh, I don't remember it's Afghanistan, Iraq, one or two. Uh, a latrine cleaner, you know. Uh, the whole time he was gone on uh, uh, active duty, active duty, he was paid the entire time. Was there was there any reason like uh, was he on other words orders 
like if you're deployed, sometimes sometimes the company will still pay you even though you're being deployed. But out of tax dollars? I don't know. That shouldn't be a lot out of tax know dollars. I know, I know some people are if, paying. If we didn't approve it, why should we Why should we pay it? You're telling me 18 months being paid and you ain't even put the uniform on or, or clocked in or set your ass in that cruiser? You deserve to be paid twice by our government? Listen. Yeah, we're working on it. We're, 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 we're working, working on it all, yeah. I mean, it's uh, it's being worked on. Just, I know you I know you know who it is. He's here in Brantford. Patrol's here in Brantford. Well, she, the problem is, if he's on a different shift... No, he's working right now. There's deputies that work here that I don't know. Uh, right. What okay. about Joe? You know Joe? Joe who? Wallison? Uh, I've met him before. Yeah. yeah. But I don't think he's he shouldn't be on right now. I yes, think. he is. Yeah, he's on. That's him. That's who it is. You know, his dad was a doctor over at the health department over there. He was over that department of health in Swanee County. He was hired for a favor. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know that about him. And so it's being spotted. Hey, stop doing that. Here, go to go to military, grow up a little bit, and come. Back. We're gonna hold your job for you. But there was a form. There was a form that the military sent to the sheriff's department with a questionnaire about his history. Right. There was ten questions listed, and eight of them had to do with whether he's been investigated, he's committed a crime, and all that kind of stuff. And they lied on it. They completely lied on it. You got to figure out. If, you know, they could do a meeting. Get it investigated. Will oh, you investigate hey, it? We're going. I'll give you all see, the paperwork. I have it all see, in my possession. See what we're doing. That's an FDLE. That's an FDLE animal there. See, see what FDLE we're doing. FDLE don't know nothing about it. No, they the paperwork wasn't transferred to FDLE. No. Columbia County was never notified about the crime that was committed in their county either. It was kept in-house. And the reason why we talk about it like this, especially when, when people watch it, is is to make sure all the residents here see it, is hear it. Is car in lock? No, about it. You follow car in lock? Yes, sir. Will you unlock it? I can't. We, we do that? I'd like to search for drugs. Can't search it. There's a fire on it. Oh, I don't want to fire anything. <laughs> Excuse me, I think he's growing stuff. First He's growing weed. Oh, that's right. That's just a plant. That's just plants. So that big tractor and trailer, he waved right past. No big deal. Well, the thing is, is a lot of these are local. You know, yeah. they come through here all the time. They already know what they have. And I, I've the been is. waved by too. Yeah, it happens. And then this guy that's growing flowers, he obviously oh, knows who they are. He obviously knows who they are. He's uh, he's checking them out. See what I'm saying? Has this guy been through here before? Him? Yeah. This company. A company. This company comes through here all the time. I'm going to give it to you. These cars are a little cleaner than what uh, the last one I investigated was. You got some uh, scissors, seatbelt cutter in there. Do you wear your seatbelt? Yes, sir. All the time. All the time. Uh, good answer. Got some Germex in there. Got all this stuff. Got this, uh, it's got Germex in there. That's cool. A lot of them don't carry that stuff. Or at least when you ask for it, they don't have Lights work good on it. What do you have in the back? 30,000 30, miles. Yeah, it's a good one. Another nursery. Yeah, go ahead. Take it go. Another person. I've got to set the car lock it. Hey, we got you. We understand. Another nursery. Investigate. Finish investigate. Act color. They have Fabuloso. That's good. More laser. Generator. Yeah, see this stuff here?
The Beluso. Yeah, this is uh, <laughs> this stuff here. Keep out of reach of children. No, we left the seat up. We left the seat up because we checked contraband. This is not allowed to be pumped into the rivers and streams. Hey, that's better than the one I was in. What did you go do with that for? Well, that was, uh, I was, we were, uh, we were out driving, walking around with a camera. Tire. You change your own tire or do you call it? Change your own tire. What's in the back? Body? That'd be a small body. No, actually it's a, uh, we have life preservers and a life ring because since we're so close to the, uh, river, the yep. river, the problem is, is you got this gear on, <laughs> you have to lock it up, but you still can't get from drowning. Yeah. You know how it's flying. You know how it rolls. Yeah, I do. It, it flies. See, I I'm do. surprised they don't give you officers vests that have a, a strap on it that blows up. Like a Mustang vest. That, that would be a little expensive, I'm, I'm sure. Plus, for as much as I'm going to be in the water, I really don't well, see I mean, in the I'm, water. I'm just, remember, uh, I'm just talking about the ones that's close to the river that, that have that opportunity to save well, people. Most of, most of them are right, right by the river. Yeah. So, what do you got on your vest? I got phone, my gloves. You don't. You guys don't have body cameras? No. Is that, is that personal phone? No, no, it's just personal phone. And it's place to put it. I got a utility, I got three pairs of extra gloves, I got an extra mask in here. What kind of gloves? Just a latex gloves. Okay. But they're a little bit thicker than the standard. Yeah. Because if we go to a wreck sometimes. Six mil, ten mil, seven, ten. Have you ten. shot anybody before? No, don't want to. Good. That's good. Good. Uh, what do you have on the back? That's uh, not the radio. All the stuff here, radio, flashlight. Yeah. Taser cartridge, taser, two magazines, key like clip. What's this, mate? This is uh, pepper spray. What? What? Uh, how many millions is that? I do not know. Let's let's read it. It might be ten million. OC. Five point three million. They give you capsaicin two percent. What's the million? No such. What brand? Defense Technology. Is that state issued? State issued, sir. I hate this stuff. <laughs> we run a cop over there, 40? Yes, sir. But back to why I was in the police cruiser. We were like 11 blocks away from where we come from. And we were out doing this, and we were talking to an officer, and he says, there's a thunderstorm coming. You guys want to ride back? It's like, nah, we got this. Nah, come on, come on. He said, you, we can continue this in the car. So he stuck us in the back seat, and there was a piece of plastic that was over the seat, and I'm in there cramped all like crazy, right? And I'm sitting there talking. He goes, oh, no cameras, though. I'm not allowed to have cameras in here. <laughs> so he gave us a ride back yeah. anyway, you know. It was all in good fun. We were having fun with him. I mean... And that's what we like to do, you know. That's what keeps, that's what keeps the, the disconnect from happening. Yeah. You know. I mean, there's a lot of disconnect. And, We're all uh, humans. Yeah. You know, uh, Townsend, Charlie Townsend. He's had got. He used to be right here. I know Sergeant Townsend. Uh, I think there's, that's what uh, I'm talking about. The, okay, there's. He's up on the interstate. And Corporal Townsend also. Yeah. yeah. Good people. Even though he's an ag cop, he's still good people. Hey, I don't hold it against him. I did all my hoorah for God and country in '87. See, so you were in. Thank you. You were in uh, Miami. You said we yes, a cop sir. there. No sir. Yeah. Okay. okay. Private Lord Byron Light. Oh, power guy. Oh Cold my climate. God. He just does it in the daytime. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay. Hey, no nice chat, oh, man. Hey, you guys have Very respectful. Hey, thanks. I'll fist bump you. Yeah, there we go. Thank you. Take care, man. Appreciate you make the, you make the Ag road. Department here look good. I try. You'll do better if you go inside and close that blind. Nobody can see that big head you got. Nah. <laughs>
<laughs> they got eggs like yep. right here, a bunch of computer wires in here. Like, and even proof. One line. Go find Chinese food. Chinese food. Chinese wrappers. Oh yeah. Very good. Michael Landis, definitely Michael Landis car. Who's that picture of Ashley Moody? <laughs> Who is that? Oh, oh. Who is who? 53. 53. Oh. No time this time. Yeah, I know that guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you guys covered by Union? We are covered. Oh. No PO doesn't fly. No PO doesn't fly. I would mind one, but that's me. Do you know uh, if you ever see a post office that one, it's against the law? The post office has one, it's against the law. If they, if they don't, don't have if one, it's against it. the law. A lot of I've, crazy. Seen, I've seen places that had it that I was actually surprised that had it. I can't think of where they were, but because you know, some of yeah. the places nowadays are no. they're afraid to do this or afraid Federal to do law that, post so. office has to fly one. Bag. But what's the problem is... Check her hey, take care, man. Okay, I'll be back. Uh, okay, that's so uh, Spag in Brantford. Uh, as you heard it, his name was Spag. Agricultural Spagnola. Cops Spagnola. He's the ag cop here in Brantford. Very nice guy. Very cordial conversation. Now maybe we can get the town hall. The town hall. See what they mulch with here in Florida, folks? Pine needles. Tons and tons and tons of pine needles. Yep, sir. Smile, you're on camera. <laughs> ah. Hello, I need to make a public record request. Smile, you're on camera. Yeah, right there it is, see? Cam back. So I guess we won't get a public records request here today, huh? Well, somebody's here. Yeah. Oh.